Hi everyone, <clears throat> welcome to Slim Chat. And uh, I'm a bit uh, suffering at the moment with the allergies are back with a big vengeance. Um, only because of sorting out my house of all the stuff. I did quite well yesterday. I did the whole of the bedroom that I used to have. Um, all of my stuff was kind of in those wardrobes and uh, they're clear now absolutely cleared out top and bottom i found i knew it was there but i found a really old vcr machine um and some and some vcrs which are the kids when they were little so you know <laughs> that should be fun watching those i know there's more of those home movies on video somewhere so i'll have to be careful with those i know that when negan was around that's jump mike and Gemma's dog one did get broken and it was um coming out so uh in the old days we used to like put a bit of tape on and fix them so hopefully we'll be able to fix it and it didn't get thrown away or anything because the some of them you know it's nice to look back so yeah um <coughs> haven't had anything to eat yet this morning oh i don't even know what we're gonna have today um gary's gone for an angina test at the hospital so and he's off for a few days now so he's going to be helping me with clearing out the house plus um on sunday he wants to make my birthday meal that he didn't get to do because he was working so that'd be nice and uh then the monday is the end of the line for eating anything naughty not that i'm eating anything naughty now you know, it's just, as I said, the wind down where I'm cutting it out gradually and getting ready to start. And this will be last chance saloon for um, for food. From then on, it's strictly by the book. Nothing out of the way. You know, I know it's a lifestyle. And, um, you know, there will always be things that crop up, but they can crop up as much as they like. Because I'm not... There's always a ways round things. <clears throat> Excuse me, I really hate feeling like this. Why do I have to have allergies? You know, I often, I often lament this, you know, when there are people that go through life without an allergy, and I have so many. I feel like everything attacks me when I, when I get like this, you know, no matter what it is. So, you know, probably have to stay away from the cat at the moment. Until it all settles down and then everything will be fine again. And every time I have a bit of a, a sniffle or I feel it at the back of my throat or anything, I think, oh my God, I hope I haven't got COVID back. But, you know, it probably just is complete and utter allergy to dust, I think. I feel a little bit like I'm glowing today, like my, my, my light is too much. And I think I know why. Excuse me. I did a video about lighting on Rocksteady which if you haven't watched it it's quite interesting the concept of it rather than the actual <clears throat> video itself the the subject matter is making the best of your own lighting because it's all very well when you see these glossy entrepreneurs and my ears have popped sorry um who do these videos that have amazing equipment and you know thousands and thousands are spent on cameras and lighting and big old lighting rigs at that and they show you how to do it that's fine if you happen to have thousands to spend but when you're starting out you've got nothing really apart from your phone um and then eventually i mean i now got a ring light you know but back in the early days i was just setting up my tripod trying to find an area that was the best lighting and then if I turned it, maybe it was better. If I turned it this way, maybe it was better. If I went away from the window, maybe it was better. You know, it was kind of a trial and error. And the actual thing that I noticed was if I tack light from three angles, it works. So I've forgotten to put my third angle on. So yeah, if you have, if you want to know more about that, then that video is on... Uh, Rocksteady along with the other YouTube help videos so if you haven't watched it <clears throat> please do I'll try and remember to put a link at the end for that so uh, yeah it may not be 
the best quality video you'll have ever seen. I'm not a bright, glossy entrepreneur with all the fancy equipment. But um, it's just a little way. I mean, some days, you know, in the early days when I'd do a live stream, I would be a bit dark because I couldn't get the light in the room right and stuff like that. So it's worth watching if you uh, if you want your subject lit. So um, that being said, um, I got a light box uh, the other day ah, and I'm kind of going to do a little bit of a video on that as well. Uh, once I've got that up and running on how to use it. Isn't that better? No. <laughs> so yeah, that'll be another one that appears on Rocksteady. Um, I wanted to try one before. Uh, mainly for when I sell bits and pieces, like on eBay. You want the picture to look really good, don't you, when you're going to sell it? <coughs> I didn't get a very big light box, so I won't be selling anything massive. <laughs> Not in that thing, anyway. So, I'm going to get off and upload this video. I know it's not a very long one. But um, if you could, um, you know, just have a little look through um, the video. If you haven't already um, entered the competition to name my channel, then please do, because that's going to get picked. Um, and if you haven't already subscribed to Rocksteady, then, then please do. And uh, I could certainly use some subscribers, watch time, all that sort of thing. So um, that would be cool. So thanks for watching and stay safe. Take care, everyone. And as soon as I get stuck in, maybe I'll do some recipes. And uh, Gary wants to do a few, I know. So bye for now, everyone. See you soon.